Good morning, it's time for uh, this week's video diary. Uh, I'm in Warsaw today, uh, sat on the stage, uh, just setting up for EFMRA, the uh, Pharmaceutical Market Research Association Conference. I'm speaking about the impact of uh, AI and augmented reality later, uh, trying to bring together some really interesting themes that have been pulled out in this conference, particularly around the impact of AI uh, on our understanding of people and needs and the way that brands communicate. Um, so on to this week's question. Um, the big question that came out this week actually came from a radio station rather than one of you. Uh, so do get your questions into me if you'd like to get some answers. Uh, but this one was about flying taxis. Uh, are flying taxis a reality? Uh, will we ever have flying cars? And the answer to those two things is probably uh, yes and yes, but when is the issue? Um, in terms of flying taxis, it looks like we're going to have those in the next five years, albeit on very limited routes. You're really only looking at places where it makes economic sense and where the safety issues can be overcome. So expect to see them flying between uh, sort of major airports and cities where road congestion is particularly bad and public transport isn't fantastic. In terms of flying cars for all of us, I think that's quite a long way off, to be honest. The safety issues, the technology issues, and fundamentally actually the environmental issues. You don't really want to be having everybody consuming enormous amounts of energy flying around rather than rolling, which is a lot more efficient.